Hey everybody, it's Bona, 63 Sonotech. Um, I want to show you my prototype for my first pin cushion. I've been watching a lot of videos and people have been making my, there's been some kind of challenge out there. Um, and I wanted to attempt my hand at it. So this is my first attempt. Um, you remember the um, candy containers I told you about that I had at work? Well, I used one of those as the base. And I used um, these fabric squares that I bought at Big Lots. Um, got them all kinds of colors and um, patterns and everything. And I used this one, um, pretty orange, and it kind of wanted to look like it was a little flower pot. And as you can tell, I used um, a couple of sprays of flowers. I got these from Silpa. Hi, Silpa. And um, just beautiful blue, orange, and some white little sprays. And those are the colors in the paper. And I used a blue, I don't know if you can see there or not, blue lace at the bottom and an orange and white lace on the top. And there is the actual top of it. Um, we've got to practice on how to do this better. <laughs> um, and how to make the paper around an odd shaped container stand out better. But anyway, this is my first attempt. Um, tell me if you like it or not. Um, I do. And there's two. one other thing I want to talk about. When I was making this, I tried to use my E600 and my Tombow, and neither one of them would hold the lace trim to this plastic. And I don't know if it was just not made for it or what. I was just furious. And you know what actually stuck? Good old red sticky tape. It, it made everything stick, so that's what I ended up using. I was really kind of disappointed in both of these that it didn't work, but... You know, you try and try until you get it right. So, there is my first attempt at a pin cushion. Hope y'all like it. Thanks. Bye.